Jordan Rowrell is behind bars and members of the community safe after police arrest him for what started as threatening remarks he posted on social media. The individual had threatened um, his own lawyer. He had threatened a judge. And I'm hearing actually he had been in contact with other elected officials, including uh, potentially a congressperson. So uh, saying some very dangerous inappropriate, threatening messages. It all started when the new Hudson man failed to appear in court last Wednesday on a fleeing and eluding charge issued by Novi police and deputies went searching for him. That's when the mother of the suspect's child told police about the threatening messages. Actually was seen driving outside of the courthouse of the judge he had threatened and took off running. And police kept searching. He ran from a number of police agencies, including in Ohio, where they chased him back into Michigan, and obviously their jurisdiction ended. It took about two days. Different police agencies tried to take him into custody, he kept running. That's when the Oakland County Sheriff's Office Fugitive Apprehension Team stepped in. And ultimately, my Fugitive Apprehension Team found him in Brighton, where he still tried to fight and run, and he actually ended up breaking some facial bones on one of my detectives. Fox 2 reached out to Judge Travis Reeds and the attorney, who both were the target of threatening messages by the suspect, and neither would comment. As for the suspect, prosecutors have issued two additional felony charges against him, and detectives are seeking additional charges after the suspect resisted arrest and assaulted and injured a detective. I mean, clearly he was unhinged the way he was acting, the way he was threatening people across the board, including his own attorney. Dangerous minded and dangerous acting individual. I'm very proud of our fugitive team that found him and took him off the streets. And Pontiac, Ingrid Kelly, Fox 2 News.